Hey, everybody. Thanks to cheating, I think I've almost done it. Though it was not easy. Okay, down. Down. Left. <gasps> we did it. Gorgolok, the Infernal Sail. Hop off the final stepping stone on the rocky island rising up from the boiling lava. Central, well, only feature of this island is an ancient weathered stone altar. Inscribed with weakly glowing runes that stir strange feelings of recognition deep within you. Hampered by his flippers, Gorgolok is fumbling with a large oily black candle you know instinctively is a not an appropriate votive offering for the shrine. Quite the reverse. That's an ancient seal clubber shrine, you shout. I don't get why it's here, but what the heck do you think you're doing to it? Gorgolok turns to you, his eyes inflamed with hatred and madness. No more. No more clubbings. I take power from this rock and I destroy you. And the rest of puny humans too. Like hell you will, you shout, charging forward in a rage. Gorgolok rears up and slams to the ground, crushing you beneath his massive bulk. You twist and struggle, manage to free yourself before you can get your fa his fangs into your neck. Club foot, bam. Chadwick doesn't give a shit. Okay, great. Thanks for nothing. Smack. <gasps> Stun resisted. Rut row. Oh, cool. That was it. Can I heal? Nope. Final blow knocks Gorglock into the edge of the island, where he scrabbles desperately with the rock at his flippers, trying to keep himself from falling into the lava. Glares you with hatred in his eyes, and he shouts, No, you not win! And his claws slip, and he falls backwards. Kakela Chuck! He screams as he tumbles backwards. Lord of revenge, give me strength! He hits the lava with a glorp and vanishes beneath the surface. There's an ominous moment of silence. And I close up my tabs because I'm pretty sure I'm done. Holy shit. Wow. <laughs> oh my god. That is that is some really awesome art, honestly. It reminds me of like a uh, like problem sleuth. That's that's unironically really, really good. The demonic hell seal, Gorgolok. Rocky Island shudders beneath your feet as a tremendous rubbling shakes the cavern. An explosion of lava bursts from the fiery lake, and you cover your face to protect your you cover your face to protect yourself from flying droplets of red hot magma. Organ music fills the air as you slowly lower your hands to witness a monstrosity rise from the molten rock. Wreathed in flames, Gorgolok levitates in the air, his skin burned black and red. Long clots of tentacles sprouting from his spine. Writhing in the steaming haze, howling wordlessly in pain and fury, he swoops at you, knocking you backwards. You hit the stone altar heavily and sit, dazed as the demonic beast prepares to charge you again. Blinding flash of light and a chorus of heavenly voices rises in counterpoint to the ominous organ music. You watch mystified as your hammer of spiny transforms before your eyes, becoming the ancient short-handled sledgehammer. The iron head engraved with glowing runes of antiquity. As the light fades, the hammer rises into the air, pulling you to your feet. Gorgolok ro roars again, the only discernible word being, DESTROY! One of his tentacles stab the ground, the claw breaks off in the rock, but regenerates. There's a low rumble, and with a tearing splitting noise, bony spikes burst off from the floor and shoot in the air, surrounding him in a protective cage that swifts that shifts and swirls around him. Destroy The demonic seal's spear like tentacles pierce the air, skewering attempting to skewer you where you stand. You hurry each one desperately, but one sneaks in three defenses and opens a large gash in your solar plexus. You deal one hundred and Oh wow, it did no damage to him but it did damage to one of the bone spikes surrounding him, snapping it. Uh, the same thing happened. What happens if I do this? Fumble! You drop it on my fucking solar plexus. Shit. Uh, razor sharp fangs clamp shut on my shoulder. You scream in pain as he shakes you like a ragdoll and throws you towards the edge of the stone island. As you manage to catch yourself at the, you manage to catch yourself at the slip of the platform and shakily climb to your feet. Let's be a little conservative here. 108 damage. Oh, I'm going to run out of health. Shit, 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 shit. Charges towards you, knocking you backwards with the force of an oncoming train. You're slammed backwards in the stone altar and gas with pain, feeling a grinding in your chest that indicates several broken ribs. Oh boy. Can I stun him? Hmm. Not good. That's, uh, that's not good. I'm I'm really just trying to think about what the hell I should even do here. Beehive. Shake the beehive in the opponent's direction. An angry bee flies out and stings for zero damage. Hammer the bone spikes with all your might, but six damage is enough to break him. Another bee for nothing. 
Another B for nothing. Opponent is too busy sweating away bees to attack you. Interesting. I like that. Okay. Gorgolock beats the shit out of me some more. But a lot of these are dead. Shit. I don't, I don't know if I'm going to survive this. This is really hard. Um, can I do another one of these? Ugh. He grabs and lifts me in the air with his new arms. I struggle mightily to feel myself and eventually do, but not before he rakes you with his flippers, opening long parallel gashes in your chest. Gorgolak charges towards you with the force of his oncoming train. You're slammed backwards in the stone altar and gas with pain, feeling a grinding in your chest that indicates several broken ribs. Okay. Shit. All right. Let's heal myself. Okay. Now, let's look for anything that could possibly help me at all. Per adventure. Hmm. Oh, this would be pretty good. Damage reduction is pretty good. Hand shock. Yeah, I'm going to want that. Regular attacks don't miss. Okay, so I'm not going to miss and I'm not going to fumble. Hmm. Handsomeness potion. That adds to monster level. I do not want that. Um, muscle and moxie, but less mysticality. Oh, I want that. I definitely want that. Yeah, I don't care about mysticality right now. Just get all of those in. Toss them in me, yeah. Grab some of these. Weapon damage plus 10. Let's grab one of those. I'm going to need a lot more mana. Or muscularity points, excuse me. This reduces my muscle. I do not want that. Hmm. Think, think, think. Well, let's go to the consumables, aren't we? I am too full to eat these. What about these? Restores MP and removes some effects. Okay, hit points and muscularity. Let's see if I can um, buy some muscularity. Or, uh, yeah, muscularity restores. Okay, what about the... Regenerate some MP... Yeah, this is all crappy soda water. Restores three to five MP. We can do better than that, right? Let's see if there's anything else here. Dicalactics. Nine to 11 MP. Hit points. Hit points. Oh, that isn't bad at all. I'll take one of these. I guess I'll take one. I'll take a couple. MP Regen. No, let's not look at MP Regen. Let's just see if I can... All right. Let's crack some of these open. Vitality Syndrome. Not the correct dosage, but who wants half empty serum bottles clogging their inventory? All right. Got a lot more of that. Let's track some of these. Can I? Damn. Okay, it's a once a day thing. Oh, if I if I had gone here, that would have. Uh, hmm.
Interesting. Let's uh, try the paddle phone. Bunch of dudes roll up to me. I don't want to waste my adventures of good shit. How do I get Cloak at Cola? Huh. From a battlefield. Is that the battlefield? Nope, it's in the Cola Wars. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. Carbonated soy milk. I've had that. Hmm. I just want to be able to buy stuff. What about you? No, not really. Ah, and I used all my fury too. Shit. Well, let's just, uh, let's buy 10 of these. And then let's use 10. Okay. This is, this is go time. This is zero hour. This is, it's time. Oh, nice. We just start here. Gorgolak charges towards you, knocking you backwards to force some oncoming train, yada, yada, yada. We already did this. Okay. Thrust smack him for a little bit. One of the things gets snapped. Okay. Gain two hit points. See, what I'm trying to do is u utilize these to gain hit points. Oh, shit. I didn't fucking swap out Chadwick. Shit. Okay. Come on. Okay. Deal a bunch of... Okay, he's out of bone spikes. Let's try one of these, shall we? Monster defense reduced by six. Okay. We're actually hitting him now. Lunging thrust smack. Gain one hit point. Spear like tentacles. Okay. We're not doing a bunch of damage. Let's wallop him. Ugh, that's not a lot. What's this? Bashing slam smash? Whoa! It worked! I work up a bashing slam smash. Club him like there's no tomorrow. No! No! Gorgolak rolls furiously. You not defeat me, I destroy you! With one final desperate leap, he throws himself at the stone altar. The ancient glyphs flare with a dazzling white light and the shrine explodes. You're thrown head over heels and land on your back on one of the floating stepstones. Stunned, you can only watch as the mountain begins to shake. Boulders fall from the ceiling, sending guts of lava spraying out of the lake. You cover your wits just enough to get back to your feet and scramble for the tunnel entrance. You risk a quick look backwards. The central island has collapsed from the magma and Gorgolok is nowhere to be seen. You make your way through the cavern tunnels quickly as you can. Ground shaking on your feet and a wave of molten rock hot on your heels, literally. Upper levels are full of hell steels, but in the confusion panic, they hardly notice you. Race out of the cave entrance, just ahead of the rock slide that buries the opening forever. Look back, you see smoke pouring out of the top of the volcano. But it and the earthquake soon subside. It looks like there's not going to be a full-scale eruption, luckily. Fleeing the underground tunnels was one thing, but you wouldn't have bet much on your chances of getting off this island alive if the entire thing had exploded. Booze and battered, you make your way to the spawning ground, a path where the baby seals, mother, and the few males uh, skip the collapsing tunnels are staying around and bellowing in confusion. They largely ignore you and collapse on the beach near your rowboat, panning for Beth. Whew. <laughs> I did it. I finally defeated him. We got Claw the Infernal Seal, instant karma, and in the heart of the volcano. Gleaming, multifaceted ruby the size of a grapefruit, warm in your hands and glows with a fire, grows from a deep within with a deep red... F it glows from within with a deep red flame that brings to mind the primal fires of the planet origin. I, if I told you that this is the heart of the volcano it was beating, then from what you've seen, you'd believe me. You could buy a lot of bubblegum with this thing. It's an accessory. It regenerates a bunch of HP and MP per adventure. That's pretty kick-ass. 
Instant Karma, shimmering ball of positive energy is a cosmic reward for a good deed well done. It's going to get you, get you right in the face. It's five toxicity, but it's a spleen item. What is toxicity? I've never even seen that. Well, what if we just try this? All right. Gain five spleen. There's a, oh, there's a thing that can hurt your spleen. Interesting, I had no idea. Weird. Who knew? Yeah, I literally had no idea. Okay. Heart of the Volcano. Oh, and Claw of the Infernal Seal. It's an accessory. You tore this long dagger-like claw from one of the tentacle arms that spread from Gorgolak's back during his transformation. Its scorched and blackened edge is wickedly sharp, and it radiates the power of anger and aggression. In short, it's the perfect thing to tuck in your belt to make you look more intimidating. It's an accessory. It requires 45 muscle, and it's part of the legendary regalia of the Seal Crusher. Uh, gives me 11 muscle. I regenerate a bunch of it. HP, and I get an additional five seal summons per day. Shit, that's, uh, that's, that's really kick-ass. Let's use this. <gasps> it gave me adventure! Yeah! Yes! Oh, I'm so pumped. You lift the carbon in the air and let it shine down on you. You feel sweetness and light and saffron for some reason. That's weird. 22 adventures and a bunch of stats. Fuck, yes, fuck, yes, fuck, yes! All right, let's uh, let's get myself out. Scalp, steel spine, sledgehammer the Velker. In the fridge of Northlands, when a warrior dies, a beautiful armored opera singer flies down from heaven to carry him to the feast hall of the gods. They are to party and revel and brawl and quaff and brawl for the rest of eternity. These angels of the Velker, and they carry sledgehammers to make sure the fallen warriors are actually dead and not just faking it. For Twenty to forty damage. Holy shit! Plus twenty three. Muscle, more transit crit. Oh my god. Plus 20 physical damage. And I get that special attack that I used. Wow. That's that's really good. Let's get that off. Let's put on that heart of the fucking volcano. Now this is actually pretty weak in comparison. So let's find that claw of the infernal seal. All right, scalp of Oh yeah, the the, the pants. <laughs> I look like shit. Okay. Seal Slayer custom outfit. Fuck you. Oh wait, not this. Allow me to paint your portrait. The ancient artifacts of the Seal Club are incorporated into a single glorious outfit. You must allow me to commemorate this for posterity. <laughs> what you guys got to say? This is Alfred. Welcome back. I have excellent news for you. I got some pretty good news myself, you say. I've defeated my nemesis once and for all. That's fantastic. I didn't really see anything about an artifact that's uh, vital to the future of the world or anything, though. Oh, yeah, about that. Uh, that's what I want to tell you. I found it. You found it? It turned out to not be missing. See Larry over there. Hi, says Larry, waving. He said not to be clean, and he forgot to tell anyone. Hey, sorry about that. Larry's new. But uh, we got it back now, and you beat your nemesis. That's, uh, that's terrific. That's not to have to worry about him anymore. Yeah? Should uh, give you something for your trouble. Here's some meat. Take a vacation or something. You've earned it. Thanks. You muttered dryly. Still waiting on that. Okay. Wow, yeah. That's everything, huh? Shadow of Black Bubbles. Oh, cool. So it's it's random. <gasps> Whoa! I deal like 800 damage to him. No shit, new damage record. Shadow of Black Bubble Black Bubbles. Wow, that was that's impressive. Okay, so these are all random seals. Random high level seals by the looks of it. Heat seal. 
Okay, so yeah, I thought it would be the heat seal every time. But it looks like the heat seal has its own item. Holy shit. Sizzling seal fat. Oh, man, I got to find out what that is. It's a potion. Move over, bacon. There's something better. Flask of boiling seal blubber. More combat initiative. And a bunch of hot damage. Nice. Nice. Shadow Black Bubbles. Uh, yeah, it's the same. It's the same one. Wow. I'm so strong. All right. Those are my five extra seals. Damn. I finally did it. I finally did it. Oh, I'm so pumped. I'm incredibly pleased with myself. Oh, right, right, right. I took off my stuff. Okay. Um, That was pretty kick-ass. But let's put these back on. What all was it? This is actually a really good item. Yeah, 20 to 40 damage. That's better than anything I've ever put on. Um, let's offhand this. Because what is this? Yeah, it's only 28. And the frost damage you get is nice. Not to mention the um, regeneration to HP and MP, but unfortunately, I don't think that's going to cut it. I uh, got my pledge pin. What else did I have to put on? Oh, yeah, the pants, the pants. Uh, denim pants. When you get stuff like this, where um, items where you get them at different times, but then you you get the items at different times, but then they they all you know you level past it and you level to get the next thing. I kind of wish that um, you would actually just get. Uh, upgrades to all of them because i got an upgrade to the weapon um yeah i kind of wish that i would have gotten upgrades to more of them but yeah that was uh that was amazing that's a really good episode is that the 40th episode it's the 41st episode well that's a good 41st episode um i'm gonna be able to record one more tonight which is good so uh i'll see you guys next week i am an alfred this has been a kick-ass seal fighting adventure. And uh, see you guys next week. <laughs> oh, I did it. Fuck yeah.